जिंदगी एक सफर है सुहाना यहाँ कल क्या हो किसने जाना This video has been prepared to illustrate the law of conservation of linear momentum. The law states that in the absence of any external force, the linear momentum of a system of masses remains constant. So, if a system consists of masses m1, m2 and m3 moving with velocities v1, v2 and v3, then the linear momentum of the system is given by p is equal to m1 v1 plus m2 v2 plus m3 v3 and so on. In the absence of any external force, the initial linear momentum of the system will be equal to the final linear momentum. Let us analyze this law with the help of the animation. Assuming that there is no friction present between the rail cart and the track and that there is no air resistance, we can conclude that there is no external force acting on the system of carts F and Dawn in the horizontal direction. Let the mass of the carts be MC1 and MC2. Mass of the elephant be ME and mass of the donkey be MD. If the initial velocity of the system is V, then initial linear momentum of the system is equal to MC1 V plus MC2 V plus MEV plus MDV. Since there is no external force in the form of friction or air resistance acting on the system in the horizontal direction, so the velocity of the second cart will not change after separation from the first cart. As soon as donkey jumps into the air, the velocity of the cart 1 changes to equalize the linear momentum of the system. Let the velocity of carts C1 and C2 be V1 and V2 respectively after the donkey lands on the cart 2. Since no external force acts on the system of carts L and Dawn during the jump, so initial momentum is equal to final momentum of the system, which implies that MC1V plus MC2V plus MEV plus MDV is equal to MC1V1 plus MC2V2 plus MEV1 plus MEV2. Similarly, when else jumps from cart 1 to cart 2, the linear momentum of the system remains conserved. So if the final velocities of carts 1 and 2 be V3 and V4 after the jump, then final momentum of the system is equal to MC1V3 plus MC2V4 plus MEV3 plus MDV3.